Hi gang, today I want to show you Spot Me, the spot color separator for Photoshop CS through CS4. And today we're going to be showing you this on CS2. Uh, anyway, I'll go ahead and get right to it. Spot Me is a uh, spot color separator. It does simulated process and index. It does not do four color process or anything like that. It really focuses on uh, simulated process and index and works within uh, that realm. It also does um, ripless half tones and a whole host of other kind of stuff. But uh, just for the sake of the demo, I'm going to show you a quick demo on it um, just to show you what it does on uh, two different uh, images. This one is a uh, obviously a parrot image and it's going to be done on a let's say a white shirt. Um, here's our regular old channels. Here's our regular old layers. Make sure that we're working on one layer. Uh, it can be a background layer. It can be um, a transparent layer, but it just needs to be one. Anyway, I'm gonna go over and go to the actions. I'm gonna scooch back up to where am I at here? Scooch back up to right here. This is the whole entire banana right here, and we're gonna go to Steve CS Simulated Process. Anyway, uh, here we go. It's a quick process too. You can see that the uh, the image will be done really quick. Um, as you can see, it was done really quick. And let's go ahead and go through the colors. We're going to do this on white, so we don't need to uh, do a base or anything like that. But we do need a yellow. I'm going to turn the base on just so we can see the yellow. The base is white, so you can't see it, but you can see the yellow. Anyway, there's the yellow plate right there. There's the red plate right there. There's the light blue plate right there. There's a flesh that this comes up with, and you, the chances of you using it are two, uh, slim and none, but um, I stuck it in there uh, for cases where you might need a flesh, and it's very experimental at this point, um, so it's really kind of an add-on for you to mess with more than anything. Anyway, going on, there's the green. Going on, we don't really need a gray in here, per se. Um, Spot Me finds every color that's that's possible. We're not going to always use them all. Um, here's a brown, another good example. We don't necessarily need the brown. Uh, no magenta to speak of. There's a blue in here. We want to use that. It's more like a royal blue or, or a little darker, maybe more like a reflex. Anyway, and there's the black. And at this point, we're only using uh, one, two, I'm not counting the base, obviously. One, two, three, four, five, six colors right there. So if you've got a six color press, we're in business. Um, and a lot of people do have a six color press. But you're probably thinking maybe we're really missing this brown. We like the way that it uh, does this gradient and everything else. We can go over to the. Um, the actions over here. I'm going to highlight the brown screen and we're going to actually add that to a darker color. Maybe we're going to add it to, let's say, um, depending on what it's up against, I'll add it to the dark blue or something like that. And we're going to add, let me select that dark blue and we're going to add the brown to the selected channel and away it goes. And now we're going to ixnay. We're going to start this all over again as far as uh, what colors are selected. Yellow, red, light blue, green, no brown, dark blue. So now we're getting this back. And we're actually getting it back in kind of a nice fade as well. And then there's the black. I'm going to scooch in on this so you can see it a little bit better. And you can see that the uh, spot me does a great job of cutting color. Um, this is a very cool separation in itself. And these will come out more of a dark color rather than a purple color. Um, I'm going to back this up just a little bit here so you can see how good of a job this did. This is the simulated process version. Um, you can actually do things like say you um, need an open head. You only have five heads. You have a six color press, but one of your heads is jacked up. It's been jacked up for years and you really just don't have any ambition to fix it. 
Uh, we can go in and uh, into the spot tilities here and let me see I'm gonna take two of these actually it's not in the spot tilities it's in the simulated process itself and we're gonna mix the blues I'm gonna put the blues together and of course it spot me goes back and puts all the channels on again we're gonna go back yellow red no light blue this time because we put it in a new um, blue channel blues all is what I like to call it and the black going back whoops we're missing the green going back here's the new blue and we've done this in one two three four five colors right there because of that uh, because of that jacked up head of yours so there you go that's um, the simulated process portion